send him by uh, for physical separation in 35 seconds. Okay. Well, now I can copy you loud and clear. Approximate. In a minute, I will select depot. Okay, separation confirmed. Timer is on. And separation confirmed at 6.08 p.m. Central Time while the station and Soyuz craft fly about 257 statute miles over eastern Mongolia. Well, good luck. I'm looking at guess one to confirm, combine, confirm. I can uh, have a visual of the target. We are backing off. Well, so far it's peace and quiet. In 20 seconds, I'll be ready for A9. Stand by. Uh, that would be in order. Oh, okay. Okay, that would be in order. Yes, I can see it. Say it again. Yes, depot selection will be done in order. Okay. Uh, but again, physical separation from the International Space Station confirmed. The station was at an altitude of 255 statute miles over eastern Mongolia. Do that. Backing away at a rate of just a little over one tenth of a meter per second. R7. Okay. Step up the one confirmed. Send in S7. R7. Roman 7. Send in. We are monitoring, uh, looking at the docking port. While at this distance, uh, we can hardly notice any foreign objects if there were any, but uh, so far we confirm that it's clear. Okay. Flying farther and farther. Yes, Roman, everything's great. <laughs> Are we flying indeed? Well, so far, so good. Well, guys, best of luck. Okay, guys, bye. Uh, Depot will be firing for 15 seconds. Copy. Roman, soft landing to you guys. Thank you, thank you. Thank you, guys. Next in the timeline, the Soyuz craft will be executing a 15 second burn of two of its engines, enabling it to further separate away from the International Space Station. Depot of firing for back off. Okay, so confirmed everything is nominal and we're standing by. Okay, depot of firing. We confirm acceleration. I can and separation burn confirmed. Don't worry, we'll accelerate it. You mean that the entire engine will be a 15 second firing of the Soyuz engines, accelerating it to a little over half a meter per second separation from the International Space Station? Thank you so much for all your work and for your cooperation. They're confirming that the burn has been completed. Okay, uh, the uh, burn is complete. Back of burn. I uh, will be sending order via command radio link and then we'll be recording the descent uh, set points. Okay, we're monitoring. At 12. Again, separation burn confirmed. Okay. The 15 second burn of the Soyuz engines taking place at 6 11 p.m. Central Time. It's now enabling the craft to continue to separate itself away from the International Space Station, eventually uh, opening up to a distance of uh, 12 kilometers or just under seven and a half miles, uh, setting up the staging uh, for the eventual deorbit and landing burn. What about the photos? Did you make a few good ones? I can see the Earth. 
да? Да. Ром, отлично, отлично получилось, только солнце светит прямо в глаз. Я понял. А если... Не в ту сторону отваливайся. Все замечательно. Ой, окей. Close out the ops for page uh, 90 in Arabo will be done on your go. Copy. Сейчас будет обратно доворачивать. 90. Это хорошо. Окей. Красавица станция. Да, очень. Отпустил у нас своими батареями. Окей. Как бы, руки. We can see the entire ISS and the solar rays, like the arms stretched out to embrace us for the final goodbye. Tom, can you see? Tom, can you see? Yes. How can it be real? It seems unreal. Unreal. Итак, okay. по заключительным операциям по команде Земли будем выдавать On команды. Я передаю. МЦС Go will start doing the close out of. Я только готов к ядим. Да. I'm ready. So the Soyuz is continuing to open up the gap of distance between it and the International Space Station. Yeah. That undocking again coming successfully at 6.08 p.m. Central Time while the station was flying just about 255 statute miles over eastern Mongolia.